Hello everyone, today I am going to be talking about the Iana waist trainer. Um, before I get into that, I want to let you know I am on a weight loss journey and in the past I have been on a weight loss journey many, many years ago and one of my go-to which greatly, which profoundly helped me to be successful with my weight loss was wearing a waist strainer. It was not the Iani, but um, it was similar. It had the rubber, the rubber bones in it, and it was it was a rubber waist strainer. It tucked me really tight. Um, I didn't feel hungry. Um, throughout the majority of the day, so it helped me to control my hunger, and it was just amazing. So now I am back on a weight loss journey. Um, I call it that. I gained the COVID eighty, well COVID fifty about because I regained about fifty pounds after COVID struck. struck. So um, I have been on this weight loss journey, and I am determined to lose the weight. So one of what, what, well, that waist strainer, which I had years ago, I wore it down to threads. It got incinerated. I mean, I wore it so much that, that it was of no use anymore. I was wearing it for four hours in a day and, you know, it helped me lose the weight. I lost 38 pounds in 43. I lost 38 pounds in... 43 days. So that was a lot of weight to, you know, to lose. Um, so now, and that was in about six weeks, I lost almost 40 pounds. So now I've discovered, because I've been looking online trying to find something with like steel bone or something like that, but I wasn't, it took some time and I finally came up on this, the Iana, and I am going to try it. This is a medium. Ask me why I got medium. The medium definitely, I believe, will be way too small. Um, so, you know what I did? Because I'm on a weight loss journey, so I'm not trying to get large, nor extra large, nor anything like that. So I did get a medium. Also, what I went ahead and did, I also got a waist trainer extender as well. And guys, I think I may have to change... Or I may have to add a pants onto what I'm wearing so that I can try this on for you guys. So this is what the Iana waist trainer looks like. And as you can see, it has four, four sections of hook and, and it has if I can pull it out for you guys. Okay. Okay. So it has, this has 25 steel bones. And I don't know if you can see that. It has 25 steel bone, which is very supportive. And this should help with my posture and everything. Especially since I do mostly sitting up for like almost eight hours a day doing work. So it has steel bone on the inside, it's, it has cloth, and on the outside, it's rubber. So this is very good. That should be comfortable. I should not dig in my skin. So what I'm going to do, I am going to, it's now in the evening time right now. Actually, today is on July 12th. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's now nighttime, so I think right now I got a lot of work I have to do, so I'll probably work for like two hours. So um, I'm going to try it on without the extender, and we'll see that um, most likely it will, will not fit me without the extender. So um, I have to cut this off. It's um, pretty solid. And I don't want to break the hook, um, so I have to use a scissor for that. And um, if this does not fit around my waist, I will 
put on the extender. But let me get a bottom and I'll be right back while I try down the eyes. Okay. So I got the waist trainer, which I am going to try on as you can see. Get a lot of muffin top hanging over. So now let's get the waist trainer on. And this is the small, this is the medium to be correct. As you can see, whoop, it's not coming anywhere close. So now I know that while it's not coming anywhere close to closure, so that means I am going to add the waist strainer extender which I obviously do need and I am praying and I am hoping that this medium waist strainer along with the with the waist strainer and the extender I'm hoping that the extender will um, stretch far enough so that so that the waist strainer can fit me and you know what I thought this had 15 but it has 14 so the extender is a little bit longer than the waist strainer but it's no biggie so let's see now and I have it on the the extreme last I think I was putting that on incorrectly. So now let's see how this will work. So it is stretching. Looks like it definitely will stretch and fit. Oh, you know what? I missed one of the hooks. So I've got to re-hook this because I'm like, I'm sure it was fit. It has 15 hooks. No, I did not miss any of the hooks. I just have the waist strainer turned um, incorrectly. I think I had the top. I think the top, I think this is the top. It's supposed to be at the top of my torso. So I'm just, so yeah, it looks like the, um, the extender has one extra hook besides the um, one extra hook above the Iani hooks. So it looks like the, the uh, Iani has 14 hooks and I got an extender with 15. So um, I thought the Iani had 15, but it's no biggie. Uh, let's go ahead and put this on. Let's see. I can tell it's going to feel pretty comfortable. It looks like I may need to stretch it all the way to the last hook on the extender. Let's see how that goes. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to work my way down. And this is very, very challenging. I really was hoping the extender would work, but no. the extender, the 
parts where the hooks go into. It's just too small and it's messing up the um okay now I can get this part done. So tired. My hands and fingers. Guys, I think I'm gonna call it a day. I think that's good enough. I really don't care about the last two that I can't seem to get in because my hands are exhausted. So I'm not going to worry about those two. I got the majority of the hooks hooked and I am sweating. I am sweating like I'm sweating bullets right now. So. I don't know if you ever heard of that, that terminology before. I'll show you guys. See there, there's like no bunching anywhere. I can get these two last ones to close because my hands are, my hands are exhausted. But I can tell you my posture is way better with this. Besides all the sweating, I am so super pleased. Even though I did not get both, um, every, all the hooks hooked, I am super pleased. This is a medium and I should have gotten a large, but I'm very happy that I was able to get this. So let me put the sun up here so you guys can see. So this is how it looks, guys. And it's not completely hooked. As you can see, I have two left that I just can't, I can't get it to hook. Because this is, this is smaller than my size. What I should have gotten is a large, but I'm very happy that I got a medium because with losing weight, um, this will help me. Once I lose weight, I'll, this should last me um, for some time, you know, without having to get something smaller as I lose the weight. So as I lose the weight, I'll be able to um, hook everything and basically bring it in closer. I'm very pleased. Like I said, there's no bunching. As you can see, I am sweating just from hooking it. So that's it guys. Um, I'm gonna call it a night. This is the Iani. I'm gonna call it a night. I have sweated out everything. And this is the Iani guys. 
so guys comment let me know what you think that took literally look at my face look at all that sweat just to hook it up it took me it took me like half an hour just to get these hooked and I didn't get everything hooked still I have two hooks that I can I really kind of hook together but I am very pleased I'm gonna keep this on for about two hours it's late and tomorrow I'll put it on I I'll most likely wear it throughout the day for at least six hours tomorrow it's very comfortable so it feels like I can wear it for six to eight hours in a day but guys thank you for joining me do like subscribe comment and share this video